One of the things that drove me to explore the world was coming back to my childhood. I always wanted to do things to the extreme. And that came because of my father. My father was a very extreme, hardcore, outdoor adventurer. He always kind of envisioned his children to do the same things. And what drove me directly to walking across Africa was the idea and the notion that I think most people don't see Africa as it really is. And I think that the best way to have explored that was to walk across Africa slowly alongside with the people, going from village to village across the continent. I believe that the more people face each other from different cultures, from different backgrounds, the more we realize that we're actually quite the same. And that's not to take away from the uniqueness of your culture or from your character, but it's the sameness and the sense of our kindness toward each other. The fact that we all need the same things in order to live, to survive. These are the common things that we need to focus on more. And you can really find this, especially if you travel. Africa, to me, is the motherland. And anytime you step foot onto the motherland. Everyone has that sense of, this is really authentic. The way that people treat you, that society helps each other. No matter where you go, they always want to invite you into their homes and they would give you their last grain of rice. It doesn't matter where you are, how poor or how rich they are. They're always celebratory. They're always trying to enjoy life and they want you and others to enjoy life as well and so what that's really taught me is we're constantly worried about hoarding money for ourselves but when it comes to other people you know we see it as a charity but in Africa it's it's not like that they believe in this thing which is called Ubuntu and it basically means the betterment of humanity so all for one and one for all this is the way that we could all be this is the way that we could flourish in life around the globe and hopefully our future generations become this way.